What's up guys, it is White out here, and I am back again with yet another Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 gameplay and commentary. And today I am running the Type 95 Assault Rifle with Red Dot and Specials Package. For those of you who are not familiar with the Type 95, this is basically Modern Warfare 3's equivalent version of the FAMAS from Modern Warfare 2. This is a three round burst weapon. It is very powerful and very accurate. Now in my opinion it's a bit overpowered. It's got a lot of power. I mean it's one or two shots kills somebody. Sometimes it doesn't even take a full two shots. Sometimes it only takes one bullet to you know to do the job. And uh, I absolutely like the gun. <laughs> and I am pretty sure they're eventually gonna patch uh, patch the the power of this gun. They're going to patch it, tone it down a little bit, nerf it out. Because it is very, very powerful. A little overpowered. Um, basically, you know, this is a free-for-all. And uh, what you're going to see at the beginning of this game is me, you know, taking it easy or trying to take it easy a little bit. Because I've played probably five or six other games with these, these same guys. And uh, they are very, very campy. They like the camp. And there's actually two guys that started pissing me off because they were actually working together. One would sit on one end of the hallway, and the other one would sit on the other end facing away from each other. And they would ha basically watch either, each other's backs. Like, like little little b cabana butt boys or something like that. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, it was kind of starting to piss me off. So, you know. I did get my ass whooped at the beginning of the game because I wasn't taking my time. And I was letting these uh, campers get the drop on me most of the time. But then I slowed it down. And I made a comeback. And I finished this game off with 30 and 10. I get the game winner. I win the whole fucking works. And the reason I, you know, the reason I actually uh, started running the uh, specials package. Uh, here's, okay, here's how it goes. 50-50. Half of my classes I run a specials package. And half of my classes I run support package. I don't run the, you know, since I started playing Modern Warfare 3, I don't run the other package, you know, the assault package where, you know, you can get all these, these chopper gunners and, and uh, AC-130s and, uh, you know, gunships, things like that. I honestly don't like running that anymore because I've realized that the specialist package and the support package, you get a whole hell of a lot more points for these. And they they work a lot better, and uh, they just amaze me how how good these packages are. And uh, you won't you from now on you're not gonna see me running anything but the specialist package and support package because I absolutely love them, and that's just how it is. Someone stunned me there, and I don't know why. But get turned on, son. As you'll see right here, uh, I kept turning around. Because there's a spawn point over here, and this same guy keeps spawning in the same spot. It is uh, B Easy 2327. He keeps spawning in the same spot, but I keep turning around. I go run out, and I turn around because I know he's gonna come right back. He's gonna spawn there. And if you guys uh, play free for all and you play on this map, you're gonna realize that there's a spawn point right over here. And for some reason, they they like to run this way. And I killed him like six times over. Watch, I'm gonna get him again. He spawned way over there. I'm gonna just pop him across the way. Boom, done. Um, but then this guy comes in and he kind of he smokes me. Um, yeah, basically I do a pretty good comeback in this game. I started out doing not so good because I was letting all these campers get the drop on me. You know, came back, put the beat down on him, put the hurt on him, and uh, the specials package pays off once again. Oh, get turned on. Uh. Uh, anyways, yeah, okay, we at this grocery store here in town. I went to the grocery store, you know, I had to get some groceries. You know, so the wife didn't have to run out and get the groceries. I got some groceries. I went out to get groceries, and, I, you know, I'm walking up to the store, and uh, I look over to my left. There's this woman, I hear this kid screaming. There's this woman standing out by her car. And uh, I look over, and this woman is just wailing on her kid. Like, literally, she's, uh, oh my god, she's beating him with her purse. 
Um, this is actually her kid, it looks like. Uh, she was trying to get him out of the car, and he was acting up. And basically, when I started hearing, hearing her screaming, she wasn't doing anything. She was just trying to pull him out of the car to go and get him in the store, because she was trying to go in the store, I'm guessing, to buy groceries, just like I was there for. But she, you know, she starts... He starts screaming, so she just starts wailing on him. I mean, swinging over her head, just boom, 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 just pounding this kid into the fucking car seat. I'm like, holy shit. And, you know, I look over there, and I look at her, and she gives me the evilest look, and she just keeps pounding on this kid. This kid is bawling at this time. About this time, this kid is bawling. And... I don't know if I should tell her to stop or if I should tell somebody she's whooping the hell out of this kid. But she's literally close fist punching this kid. And, and I don't know if she's hitting him in the face. I don't know if she's hitting him, you know, in the stomach. I don't know where she's hitting him. But I can just see her swinging into the car and smacking him. She picks up her purse and starts, eh, two piece. Uh, she <laughs> picks up her purse and she starts swinging on him. She just beats the hell out of this kid in the car. And then about, I go in the store and um, about a, two minutes later, while I'm still in the store, she, her and the kid come around the corner and he's still crying. He's, he's sitting in the cart, down in the big part of the cart, and he's still crying. And I, as far as I've seen, I didn't see any, uh, any bruises on the kid or anything yet, but who knows, maybe they just didn't set in. But this kid got his ass whooped by his own mother. She's just wailing on the kid. I couldn't believe it. Right in public, right out in the parking lot of the store. I'm like, holy shit. And uh, I don't know if anyone else saw it or not. There was several people out, people out there, but I don't think they were paying any attention. But anyway, guys, this is the end of the game. This is Whiteout HDX. And watch, I'm going to get this sexy game winner here. Boom, dead. Anyway, guys, this has been a Whiteout HDX gameplay and commentary. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll be back with some more Modern Warfare 3, Battlefield 3, and other games. Peace.